lot of stuff going down in the shop. So powder coated wheels, paint protection film on this bad boy. We got the Range Rover calipers disassembled, painted up. We got the decals put on it. Right now we're going through some QC on this thing. We got something special set up for the Range Rover on this one as well. We'll kind of show you that finishing little detail on this one whenever we're done. Working through some QC on this one right here, finally finished up. We got the white seats on the interior. John's checking everything in terms of uh, all the mechanical and diagnostics, making sure that all the SRS lights and everything are good to go. But this is actually paint protection film. You can tell how high gloss it is. And of course it is a uh, ceramic coated as well, but this one got the full treatment. So rotors, calipers painted, powder coated wheels, upgraded grill, roof wrap, window tint, seats went white. Man, we did a lot on that one. Guys, this C8R is actually for sale. If you're interested in a low mileage C8R, contact us on this one. This one's listing for $119,999. Has about 7,000 miles on this one. So contact us if you're interested in a low mile C8R. We have the E30 M3, the absolute classic right here. This is a, to some people a holy grail car. This one is stunning levels to this right here. Super clean interior, manual transmission, just over 100,000 miles. This client has actually taken this on a rally. Gorgeous vehicle. Was painted to perfection. Looks really, really good. We're just doing some disassembly right now, getting everything ready. That way we can go ahead and get this one wrapped up. Got my boy Jeffries here. He's gonna help me wrap this. We're on a short schedule with this one. We're wrapping it starting Friday. Client needs it next Wednesday for a rally. G55, the wagon itself. So this one, the G Swagon, Brabus. We're waiting on the wheels to come back. Client keeps adding stuff on this one. So we got the wheel spacers and the powder coated wheels coming back and this one should be finished. We'll get some roller shots on this one. Tyler is moving on another AMG right now. So he's doing, kind of show you this real quick. So look at how crystal clear this is guys. Gorgeous. The rest of the vehicle though, we're gonna get all these spider swirls out. You notice all these spider swirls, these swirls are actually caused just by regular wear and tear, everyday washing, people wiping down a car when it has dirt on it. This is how the paint looks from the showroom, even better. So this client is just getting a correction on this one. Hopefully Tyler doesn't fall and break his face. It looks a little chalky in color right now, but once Tyler's done with the correction, it's gonna look pitch black gorgeous. We'll get the wheels cleaned up, of course, before delivery. But uh, yeah, this one is gonna look total night and day difference. We love paint correcting black cars. It's a hate and love relationship. At least it's not 300 hours on a all red 1960 Porsche. So Tesla, so this one is getting the powder coated wheels, window tint package. This is kind of an atypical package on these cars. They usually come in for the front paint protection film, emblems, um, they'll get window tint and the powder coated wheels or calipers. So quite a few things that we do on Tesla's guys. At our peak, we were doing like 10, 10 of these a week. It was pretty crazy. So, but we've kind of moved into other aspects and different cars and things like that as well. So we still love all our Tesla owners. Y'all bring them back. This one, we just finished up the design and the test print on this one. It just got approved. So we're going to send it to print and this one will be wrapping on Monday. Stay tuned. It's going to be a really cool kind of Valkyrie type wrap on this one. My traditional M3 spoiler. It's freaking good guys. BMW knocked it out of the park with this design. This car is a 1989 E30 M3. It's the same age as I am, but yet in much better condition. Timeless classic right here. Guys, phase one is done on the E30 M3. We have a red driver's mirror for inspiration because this is gonna be the Warsteiner wrap. So it's gonna have the traditional M series, blue, red, and baby blue. It's gonna have Warsteiner here decals everywhere and this one will be rally ready by wednesday gonzalez finishing up the uh, long wheelbase uh, actually short wheelbase range rover hse the calipers look sick on this we did the calipers in electric blue looks gorgeous full paint protection film on the entire vehicle window tint ceramic coating gonzo changed it up Aviators, these cars are badass. They look great, man. Cars, SUVs, they're badass. They look great. We're doing powder coated wheels, chrome delete package on this one, and smoke tail lights. This thing is gonna look sick when it is done. 
So guys, we smoked the tail lights on this one as well. We gave it that full murdered out look. I don't know what it is about a, a Range Rover, but man, you just can't go wrong with a black on black Range Rover. We got a couple of details on here that we're gonna make this one extremely unique for the owner, but it is almost finished up. Y'all stay tuned, hit that like and hit that follow. We got beautiful weather here in San Antonio this week. It's February, last week of February. Absolutely gorgeous weather that we got blessed with today. It's been pretty up and down weather. So we've kind of had a little bit weird schedule, but we got some more cars coming in as usual. So we have the classic 99 Porsche. This one's getting some paint protection film done on it. This client actually right here has the E30 M3 that we were doing the Roy Steiner uh, livery wrap on it. Came out badass. We love it. The client loves it, extremely happy. This client, we wrapped this Tesla a little while ago. Unfortunately, he had some curb rash and a little bit of collision repair, so we're gonna get that taken care of for him. We're gonna get these wheels, as you can see here, even though it's a Tesla and it can do automated driving, it doesn't save you from everything. So this thing actually has curb rash on almost all four wheels here. Robert, if you're seeing this, don't judge me, but curbs do exist, guys. You gotta watch out, okay? But if this does happen to you, bring it to us. We can get this all reconditioned. We'll re-powder coat it. We'll get it back to you. We do offer a lifetime warranty on the powder coating. This is not included in the lifetime warranty. This is considered natural wear and tear. But we're here if you need us. So this one's satin dark gray. We are gonna powder coat the wheels. He does have a second set of wheels in the back that we're gonna powder coat as well. I don't know why he has a second set, but it may be just in case this happens again. <laughs> but we have finished up the uh, Laredo emergency wrap as well. This one's headed out. They have some events that they're gonna be knocking out. With this one, it looks really, really good. You guys remember we did the matte paint protection film on the other Bronco. This Bronco, same color, no fender flare color match on it, not a hard top, but this one's going matte paint protection film. I wanna show you guys something. So you'll probably be able to notice almost instantly this door compared to this door. This one is extremely high gloss. This one has a little matte to it. That is not paint protection film. This was actually sold to the client straight from the dealership. So this paint, this door has been totally repainted. You can notice the gloss here to the mat there. So clients bring us cars all the time and, and they constantly say, hey guys, it's in great condition, this and that, don't worry about it. This is the reason why we do a really thorough look through. There's ripple effect right here. There's matte finishing. They didn't actually shoot clear on this area right here. So these are things that we have to take into account. Note them and send them over to the client and let them know. That way it just protects us and the client. Of course, we're gonna let this uh, be knowledge to the client before we install it because we want them to get to the dealership and let them know, hey, there's quality companies that are taking a look at this and unfortunately they noticed some uh, discrepancies in my paint and we need to make sure that it doesn't damage any type of warranty or anything like that so other than that the car looks great but this door was totally repainted guys ha stuff like this happens on even the highest end vehicles we'll get mclarens ferraris things like that and they're all they have repainted panels straight from the factory or straight from the dealer i mean don't be surprised but that looks terrible so it's a good thing that we noticed it with a matte paint protection film on it, it'll probably be not noticeable at all, but we do need to document that and send that over to the client.